Hello guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how to transfer files between your main PC and a virtual machine uh, because when you install a new image or uh, from a disk a uh, Windows, whatever Windows you have installed in the virtual machine uh, it will automatically it won't allow you to copy a file so like example if I copy one of these icons and go within the window and click paste it will not allow it will not allow you to paste it so the way that I have to do is they already provide you uh, some tools that will allow it. it's like drivers where you install it and then it you will restart it and after you'll be able to copy the communication you can uh, copy whatever files you want on the the virtual machine so first what you need to do is uh, where you got this uh, CD DVD the disk here you need to click it and go to setting and you got if you have it and then here is what he's saying if you got it as a physical drive like a DVD drive or as a disk whatever you can select whatever drive you want but I got mine as an image file but in this case is the file I'm gonna put on later in the description is as an ISO file so as you can see here is the window is a VMware tool for Windows 8 and you can use it for Windows 7 as well obviously but this is what you need uh, you need to select that and click OK now uh, once you click the OK uh, you will uh, when you go on your my computer uh, you will have this because you have put the ISO image there it would count here as a removal device so what you need to do is wait for it that the pop up that comes up uh, once the pop-up comes up, uh, just click Run Setup and just click Yes. And here, just you know, just wait for the prepare, you know, to, to install the software that you need, and just press Next here. You know, you can follow the custom or you can do the com uh, complete. I always just stick with the typical one and just click Next. Uh, click next uh, this won't take too, uh, too long to install you just could be a little patient on the set it will be done alright now it's finished uh, it will ask you here that you will need to restart if you click no then the effect will not take into place so you do need to click restart so the machine restart and take that installation that driver then f once the working machine is restart then you'll be able to take like files into the VMware machine like if you want some programs installed in the virtual machine then you'll be able to copy and paste into the desktop so just give it a moment so the machine restart the virtual machine Uh, as you can see I don't have mine activated you can just ask me later uh, so yeah uh, as you can see here now you should be able to copy file uh, between your main uh, desktop or windows and to the virtual machine so let's give it a test. So if you want to copy this desktop uh, icon for Team Viewer, you just click copy and go here and click paste. So obviously when you click here here it does not exist under virtual machine because 
you, you did not install so anything that you want to copy or paste anything like that you can also drag and drop so you don't have to right click or copy you can just drag and drop it and then it does it and the good thing about this is uh, you know it makes life easier instead of uh, there is other ways you can do it as well as if you do I mean this is the easiest way that you can right click and paste here the other way that you want to do it, maybe if you want to transfer file is that uh, you have to import a USB uh, device uh, into the computer then you have to import it onto the virtual machine and you have to eject it from your main PC so you know it will not connect it from this so it's only open from the virtual machine and that's how you can copy file but this is the easy way uh, thank you very much for watching this clip uh, as again if you found this uh, clip useful uh, please uh, subscribe or don't forget to like leave a feedback to keep in touch with me for the future uh, videos I'll be making after the new year etc. Thank you very much.